excited. How are you doing? You got to say hello first. I'm just trying to get stretched because I'm stiff. Welcome. Good morning. Morning. Challenge. Challenge. July. Good to be here. Good nice to, to see here. you. Philip, Robert. Okay, are you ready? Yes. All right, we're going to get straight into it. Breakfast number one. First point before we start the breakfast, I, got, I want to just explain the importance of breakfast exercises, okay? You have the functional side, which is you're going to burn more calories, you're going to get your metabolism going twice a day. Okay, those two things are really, really important. Burning more calories is amazing, getting your metabolism fired up, burning off the morning food, excellent. But more importantly than that, it's the point I wanted to make to you, because you're here, <laughs> is that basically, if you commit to the breakfast exercises, you're doing something on your own terms in your own time, under your own volition, okay? So you have to do, you know, you're, you're fulfilling that side of the bargain. You're fulfilling a commitment that you made to us to complete the challenge. So if you do that bit, what we found in the many challenges that we've run, and we've run more than one or two now, we run loads and loads of challenges, people that do their breakfast exercises do better in their diet, do better in the classes, get better results, because they're more committed, okay? So if you came in, paid your money, signed up for the challenge, do your breakfast, because it's part of the challenge. The challenge is a system. Um, it's not just a cherry picking, um, cherry, what's the word after cherry picking? Not just cherry a blossom. cherry picking extravaganza, yeah? <laughs> Rather! Oh my gosh. All right, so do your breakfast, guys, okay? So first of all, it's a simple breakfast, first of all. The point of this one is that we're going to do the two ultimate moves. The squat is the, kind of like the king of the gym, and the press up is like the squat for the upper body. So we're going to combine the two into a ladder. Yeah? So let's turn around here. First of all, we're going to teach you the form, a squat. Feet, heels straight on the floor, ass down, and you're going to stand up straight. Pinch your lower back, hit arch your lower back so that your chest stays proud, and arse to grass, okay? Nice and low. If you can connect your hamstrings and your calves, do it, go. There's this, all this crap on the internet about like, you know, go to parallel, okay? It's not right. You go deep in the squat, okay? Go deep. You must get that right, okay? So, it's one squat and then you're gonna jump down the floor, get onto the floor, you're gonna do a press up, okay? With press ups, chest falls in between the hands, release your hands and push. Chest falls in between the hands, release your hands and push, okay? Just make sure, as long as your chest falls in between the hands, that is correct. If you can't do a full press up, put your knees on the floor and everything else stays the same. Chest falls in between the hands, push. Chest falls in between the hands, push. Okay, stand up. If you're new to circuit factory or your form needs improving, go back to the last 30 seconds of the video, go over the form until you get that down. This is the breakfast. One squat, one press up. Go. Two squats, two. Two press ups, one, two. Stop. Okay, three squats, three press ups, three, four squats, four press ups, five squats, five press ups, six squats, six press ups, yeah? Got it? That's it. All right, well, very best of luck on your first week. Good luck. Do your breakfasts.